The 35-year-old, who was married to Prince William, is famed for her long, thick hair. Now the Duchess of Cambridge is pregnant with her third child, will her hair change thanks to hormones? Joanne Harold, senior master stylist at Charles Worthington Salons, explained how pregnancy affects a woman's hair. She said, on average women lose around 50 to 150 hairs a day, regardless if their hair is thick or fine. As well as the daily shred every few years women, will go through a cycle lasting about three months, where they will find hair everywhere, these cycles occur about 25 times in a lifetime after giving birth or when stopping breastfeeding, women will experience one of the hair everywhere cycles. Some women may not notice this as much, and will only realize once they find short bits, of hair around their hairline. As annoying as this can be, it is a great sign that the hair lost has reproduced, from the follicle and will grow. Joe said many women opt for a fringe or face framing layers, so the shorter hairs don't look so obvious. She explained during pregnancy hair loss will slow down making hair look, and feel thicker. This is due to the baby taking nutrients, and vitamins like calcium and keratin, from the hair components, Joanne revealed. Initially due to surges in hormones, in the early stages of pregnancy women can expect, to have unusually oily skin and hair, which may be credited for that glow women, can have throughout pregnancy. Upon reaching the second trimester this should stop or slow down. Kate is many things, a mother, philanthropist and a royal, but also a trendsetter. When she stepped out, with a new hairstyle earlier this year the fashion world applauded her. The Duchess's hair always looks thick, and fabulous, us asked how anyone could recreate this, at home. Joe said, Kate Middleton's hair is always blow-dried to perfection, with shine and volume, most likely because she knows she will be photographed. Kate's hair has always looked extremely thick, most likely due to the products she uses. If you suffer from fine hair, try using the Kirstace Densifique range. This helps to boost hair fibers, and encourage new growth stimulation, and is different from volumizing products which just sit, on the cuticle and swells hair for one Washington if we have pregnant clients, in the salon ahead of a special event, I would recommend placing some extensions, into the hair using Balmain additions. If a client is worried about coloring hair, the alternative is adding highlights, lowlights, without actually coloring the whole head. I would always recommend an additional patch test, for pregnant clients, even if I have been coloring their hair for years. I've colored my hair throughout my pregnancy, and it's fine but always best to be safe.